vuelta. We are now in Paris and didn't do too many things today because we arrived in Paris at about 3 p.m. in the afternoon and then we checked into our hotel and then we just went on to do a little shopping so time to do a little unboxing haul with me and ta-da! This is what we're gonna unbox today. Cool. Before we get into that, we want to shop and go into a shopping haul as well. I stopped by the Olympic merch store and we got a t-shirt. Super cute. Once I saw it, I just can't resist. I'm like, oh my god, I need to get it. Super duper cute. So let me show you guys how it looks. I feel like I'm going to end up collecting more merch while I'm here in Paris during this time. So anyway. This one is the Arc de Triomphe and you have the mascot, like a DJ on top. Super cute! And then the next thing can jump in right in. Nothing too fancy, but I got myself a belt. Always wanted like a proper leather belt and um, just never got down to getting one. So this is my first proper proper belt I would say so really like that classic leather belt uh, in calf shiny calf leather so yes very very classic very chic that I liked and then I also got a small uh, purse back um, this caught my attention when I was looking on the website and I realized that the Triumph canvas has a new color so I really wanted this uh, color addition since I had the leather one I just wanted to have a canvas version printed canvas one so here's how it looks super super cute and the latest uh, color that Celine has released which is the gray color I like the under certain lighting. It actually looks kind of green. So very happy about it as well. Um, and what is so cool about this one is that you can wear it multiple ways. Here, the bag comes with two straps, a longer strap, 
where you can wear it cross body and then it has this shiny strap that you can then wear as a shoulder shoulder bag under under your arms you can carry it like this hold it so this is how it look very chic I like the little chain there Fireworks, right? It went across it. That's so nice. Wow. Are these supposed to be used? So cute. <laughs> I've got a little Eiffel Tower. I feel like we paid for the 10 bucks. Wow. Even the bite. Different from Ludwig? It's airy, more airy. Oh, and less sweet. Oh, not actual. I'm gonna try this. What is this cherry? So what's um, what's the name of the the company that mm. the Segway company? Company. Yeah, yeah. It's robot. That's this bottle cap bother you? If it does, do this. So how many uh, pours do you do? Built in 1901, as you can read, in oh. 1800s, 1700s, 1900s, the government, uh, so the kingdom and later the government, used to make the competitions between the architects <laughs> who makes the most beautiful building, I uh, see. who makes the best building. It's probably an OCD's nightmare. It's perfectly asymmetrical, asymmetrical. The door is not centered. The window balconies are different. <laughs> There were lots of interesting animal carvings on it. But the main drawer is first thing in the morning. This is the view. Wow. This is the view that you would get waking up from your balcony. The Eiffel Tower. Best Segway tour. Glad to be alive. <laughs> they were speeding through the streets of Paris, going pretty fast. So we're glad that we had that training in Granada without the traffic and the cars and people. So we were able to do all that today. No issue.
with me. I am here now by myself uh, to explore the park, which is right across the street from here. This is unreal. It is so beautiful. Oh my gosh. It is so beautiful. Guys, the park is way more beautiful than expected. Wow. So glad I made you here. So let's take a walk by the site and we'll see it from here. Been a very lovely time at the park and now I am walking down the street to dinner which is nearby and just look at how pretty the streets are. Just 
big enough so you have that big city deal if you want to come out. Like a little The oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Ah, so oh, this yeah. is the, oh, pretty. the one of the three meals that we have in this area. Oh. Ah. Yeah. It's just so charming. Ah. Oh my god, I love when it's already charming. <laughs> You're gonna have three different types of cheese, okay? So the first one, I don't know if you know, it's a brie, okay? Brie, it's not far, far from Paris, uh, where it kind of started. It was in Meaux, Brie de Meaux, okay? It's like really close to Paris. And it has a strong, which is not that strong, okay? Compared to Camembert, I don't know if you have a yes. Camembert. Yes. Camembert is kind of the same family, but Brie, it's a little bit softer, okay? Mm. Then this is, okay, more age, more stronger, of course. Mm. And the one that is a, a lot age mm. is this one. Oh, no, wait. I didn't put me blue cheese. Hmm. Oh, my oh. God, this is no. really a lot, That's I have different. to say. <laughs> Amazing. <laughs> or is it what we had beginning. on the whole tour in it's Italy? Just it's the beginning. <laughs> 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 no, it's just the beginning. <laughs> no, actually, oh I, I think they didn't put one like cheese that I was cheese. expected. No, it's all right. Yeah. It's just that you're going to taste something else. So I think this one should be Comté. Oh. I don't know if you have a try Comté. Mm -hmm. It's really soft, really, really good. The Comté mm -hmm. for me, it's the best. Yeah. So yeah. It's actually better that you have Comté than blue cheese because mm -hmm. I don't know if you like blue cheese, but mm -hmm. for me, I don't really like it. Mm -hmm. It's way too strong. So actually, mm -hmm. it's a good it's a good thing. And this looks like Saint Nectar, the one that I was talking to. No. No. What is wrong with this? What is wrong? Okay. <laughs> yeah. Can you go that yeah. I know a little bit. Uh, uh, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. A famous mm -hmm. ruler that said something about cheese. He said, How can you rule a country with more than 258 soft of cheese? Mm -hmm. It means that how can you rule France? Because there's so much French. How can you rule this country? Because <laughs> when you are from Singapore, we know each other from crazy rich Asian. <laughs> I know, so my building fund is like, oh, you're crazy rich Asian. I'm like, no, <laughs> crazy poor Asian. <laughs> 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 because she has a famous movie. <laughs> Ah, uh, cute. Yeah. I already saw that. You are totally right. And we will write it down in our comments. Okay, this is a real. You will go. You will be very full. Real food. Real food. But Nino was terrible. I'm not allowed to do those street art. But since it's a really artistic area, this vibe is like artistic. You know, the government decided to leave them. We just finished lunch and now we have three more food stops to go. <laughs> Very famous movie here yes. in Paris. And it was this shot? It was shot yeah, here? Yeah, yeah, yeah. One of the. the mm. Well, mm. Yeah. did you. Know oh, sorry. I'm not trying to feel it.
a really wealthy man and he had a special connection with Paris. So in 1872, he decided to bring those one. So at the beginning, it was only a few. And he decided to make more than 50 of them in Paris. So now I see a little bit more, maybe more than 50. But they are in a lot of places. And it's to give free water to homeless people and to people that don't have access to water. So if you have a bottle, you can just do like that and pour it. Ooh! <laughs> can I reach? This way. this way I can do it. Oh! Area. Wow. And so they started the to do the, the young Picasso. way uh, in paint, painting that we call Picasso impressing. came here uh, at the age style. of 19. And uh, for example, he did a painting called like, Les Demoiselles d'Avignon. Uh, mm. really Les Demoiselles d'Avignon. And actually, this place was a whole big building. Oh. On fire in the late 19th uh, century. Oh. Uh, so this is the only part remaining. Here, okay? wow. so, uh, and bateau lavoir in French means bateau means boat, and lavoir means the place where you wash your laundry. Okay? Uh. Because really, a, no, a long time ago, it was women that used to wash the laundry in this place. Uh. And then why boat? It's because the house were built, built like a boat. Okay? Wow. So it was one big room. And then small rooms like, like okay. Mm -hmm. This is the Demoiselle d'Avignon. Mm -hmm. This painting. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Okay. This one. This is the style of Picasso. Like a, yeah. 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 no yeah. sense. Hard to exactly. Wait, so he painted it here, or? What uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. He oh. I mean, he started to paint he started like painting. in this in this square. You know, okay. maybe back then there were like, I don't know. Like things. 20 artists just like uh, you know practicing on the trees or anything. You can picture that in your yeah. Picture, it's like finding a Pokemon. I think there's Head one up of, there. Uh, one Pokemon, uh, one, uh, Dalida. I don't know if you heard. Dalida. Dalida. You, you know. Her. Well, uh, unfortunately, <laughs> same. <laughs> Why? No. Yeah, because it tells something about my age of no. <laughs> <laughs> Dalida. I know Dalida. Every yeah. French knows Dalida. Okay. Oh. Song, for example, is really beautiful because she said that she wants to die uh, on stage. Oh, wow. wow. 1987. <gasps> wow. From here. Oh, not a windmill. Oh. Wow. Like, um, but now it's 15 euros. <laughs> uh, oh, wow. <laughs> wow, big inflation. Or maybe more, I don't know. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Big inflation. Okay, historical restaurant Just here where Van Gogh, Picasso, Dalida used to eat because it used to be a cheap dish. The La Galette is the savory type of crepe um, from the place from Brittany, and it used to be just 2 euros. You, you know the difference, the differences between the olala that we use. Oh, so there's yeah, yeah. The, there's differences. Yeah, kind of. Oh, I, I, I like to tell that to the people because I see a difference. Ah. This is one of the most beautiful streets this of Mama. This is so beautiful. Like, like that, and you can yeah. see the holy uh, heart behind. Oh so, yeah. And there's like a lot of different yeah. ways to ah, say. Ah, oh, There's the oh, la, la, which is bad. So for example, I don't know. You hurt your feelings. Like, ah, oh, la, 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 la. Ah. And if you are annoyed by something, like you are tired, you will say, you will say, oh, la, la. Huh? <laughs> oh, la, 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 la. You will say like that. Okay. That is too. The last funny. one will be more like in your in the bedroom with, uh, with your ah. wife. You will say, oh, la, la. <laughs> <laughs> This so is we are, uh, hundreds of ways to say it. So beautiful. Even more famous because of Emily in Paris. So everyone uh, Oh, here. <laughs> A lot of people. Uh, you want to have the picture without the... Without uh, Emily in Paris. Emily in Paris. Have you seen this show? It's called Les Vignes du Clos de Montmartre. Okay. Mm. So the wine is not very good. Okay. 
Okay. <laughs> okay. <laughs> because okay. of the pollution, because of uh, so I the see. Oh. So, also like one euro the, 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 the oh. trash. So they went so here. That's the bar that they always and go. And lapin agile means the rabbit agile. So agile, uh, you know, agile. Mm -hmm. agile. <laughs> <laughs> agile um, and so still today, it's one of the last uh, cabaret remaining that is throwing those kind of small nights mm -hmm. shows poems ah. some people are just telling poems and then you can eat drink mm -hmm. it's a really nice uh, area a nice nice um, vibe and a fun fact also about this place is that picasso used to give them um, one painting okay oh so oh. they were really happy they put it on the wall <laughs> wow. really is it still there but actually this is the, the, the story also about that, that, is that <laughs> They had a little money issue at some point, <gasps> okay? so, so they needed to sell it really low price no. because it wasn't that famous. Right. But years before, it oh. was like millions and millions of euros. So also the moral of it, don't sell. Okay, mm -hmm. so when you know what you want, just ask him, he will give you the, the macro and then you can leave the coconut the pistachio. The blueberry, you try. Mm. Mm. Not bad. Pretty good. Good jam. It's great. It's a little tart. There's a tartness to this, so it's really good. The jam is so good. Mm. Mm. What do you think about this one compared to the essay? What do you know right away? It's more tart. The jam is more fresh. Okay. Thicker. There's more jam. Yeah. Yeah. That show? There's more jam, yes. Mm -hmm. The crust is thinner. Mm, this is more filling. Yeah, more filling, very thin crust. Mm. But that one, you know how I said you feel the denseness mm. because the, the cake part mm. was thicker. But this is uh, a lot thinner. The jam is really thick. I like this. Good. The jam is really good. The tartness of the lemon is probably my favorite. Mm. that we have everywhere in Paris, you know, yeah. with this chair, with this kind, this is what we call bistro, okay? Uh. Why bistro? It's because one soldier from the Russian army came into here, this area, and wanted alcohol fast. So he came into this place and said, bistro, bistro. Bistro means uh, quick. Oh, quick, quick, alcohol. quick alcohol. So, yeah, all about alcohol and drinking, drinking uh. people. So they are huge. So I suggest maybe if you are share. way too poor, you can share, okay? The most classical one will be sugar and what butter. The cream, sugar and butter. Very.
and I welcome you here in the name of Mark Dubois. We have the really nice Hamza and his colleague. I forgot his name. I hope he's going to forgive me. If needed, so the bar is open throughout the cruise. And there. why did they choose the Sun River for the opening ceremony? Well, first of all, because for the first time, they could have 300,000 people attending the ceremony. I'm sure they... Il copie à taille réelle de la flamme de la Statue de la Liberté à New York. Here on the left-hand side, you can see a golden flame. It has nothing to do with the Olympics, but it's called the Liberty Flame. It is a life-size replica of the flame from the Statue of Liberty in right in front of us. Probably the most iconic bridge of Paris. Le Pont Alexandre III, Alexander III Bridge. It was built also for the World Fair of 1900. The first one to cross the Seine River in a single span, connecting the district of the Champs-Élysées on the left-hand side to the Invalids on the right-hand side. Les enfants, vous pouvez regarder quand on va passer au niveau du pont ici, vous verrez un, un bateau au centre dans ce médaillon. Avec toutes les collections d'art impressionnistes et post-impressionnistes, ce bâtiment a été transformé en musée dans les années 80. On the right-hand side, the large building that looks like a train station is actually the Orsay Museum where you can find all the Impressionists, one of the largest Impressionist and Post-Impressionist collections in France, including the painting by Renoir. We have a small Renoir painting also on the façade. And if you think that the building looks like a train station with the gigantic clocks here, it's because it used to be one. It's a Catholic cathedral dedicated to the Virgin Mary. In the 12th century, most churches were called Notre-Dame in France. 